We did. Uh, about five we uh, She was five weeks when she um, started to, like, choke on her own saliva, I would say. Yeah. Um, and it got to the point of the evening that it was really, really quite You can bad. see she was really struggling There's to breathe no and everything. There's no way we could have sleep um, at and, night. So. And we, we rung 111 and just asked for their advice. Um, and they said, look, we, we feel we should send an ambulance out. And first of all, we were like, oh, my God, we don't want to have to go into hospital no. um, because of all what's going on. Um, but then the ambulance guys came in, um, suited and booted, uh, full PPE. Um, and they basically said, look, we feel that we need to take her into hospital yeah. just for a checkup. Um, so we did, because otherwise we wouldn't have slept anyway. Yeah, and the thing is, you don't want to you don't want to go to hospital because of the COVID, but you also don't want to not um, get well, attention. We would have never forgiven ourselves, yeah, would we, if, if something happened. had happened. Yeah, so. and he, he, we've been told that she's got silent reflux. Um, so yeah. yeah, it's she still struggles. So with after it. every feed, we have to hold her upright yeah. for at least oh. half an hour. Bless her, she's her. asleep now. She was <laughs> having a meltdown so just about ten minutes ago. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we were panicking, going, "Oh my god!" But we